Hi, it's Darius. And I wanna to talk to you today about what you are here to do. A lot of people have this idea that they have one life purpose or one chief thing that they're here to do as a human being. And if they don't discover it, then their life is meaningless or they completely fail or they miss the mark. And I'm here to tell you, despite what most people will tell you, mostly you will hear in sort of the mainstream circles, your life purpose may be very different than what you think and even what most people in personal growth think that they should tell you your life purpose is. And let me explain this to you. Basically, your life purpose from my experience and from helping a lot of people through the years is not necessarily one thing, one job, one role, one position, one place in sort of the world framework that you stick to because we are all evolving beings. So one life purpose over the course of a whole life may limit you or pigeonhole you or you may not be the person to fulfill that purpose yet because you haven't mastered the skills. So instead of looking for that life purpose, here's the way that I see it. Each of us are here to take something unique that we are really great at, that we effortlessly flow at, uh, something that we have a genius at, that we have an incredible ability to do. And we're here to take that gift and we're here to bring order, to bring harmony where there is chaos, where there is struggle, where there is frustration. And for a lot of people, that means maybe bringing it into the lives of others. If you are somebody that has a gift at bringing harmony or joy or love or possibility or solving business problems, solving tax problems, solving legal problems to where you shift something that was creating a huge challenge or worry in someone's life and you make it better, that's a life purpose. If you're an electrician, in my opinion, who's really great at rewiring a home and you have this chaotic wiring that could cause a fire and you understand exactly what to do because of your training to bring that into order, to bring it into balance, that's an amazing life purpose. Now, we're all here to do that in our own way, whether it's helping pets, helping elderly citizens, helping through like making videos or sharing content or doing all sorts of things, writing books, being an energy healer, being an accountant, being an attorney, being a police officer. But if the core focus of what you do is exactly what I am saying of bringing harmony where there was once disharmony, what are you really doing? Well, what you are doing is you're bringing higher energy into a lower energy world. And if that's your life purpose, guess how well that translates into hundreds of other things you could be doing with that life purpose. You see what I'm getting at here is that if you focus on bringing harmony to disharmony, then your life purpose essentially is something that could span multiple careers, multiple possibilities, multiple economies, multiple different skill sets. And you can begin doing that right now. The beautiful thing about making your life purpose about something like that is you can do that anywhere you go. You know, when I go home after making this video and I walk downstairs, I should say I am home, but when I walk downstairs, you know, there's going to be perhaps something that happened with one of my kids, right? And I am here now to be the space to take what seems like disharmony and bring it into harmony. In fact, we don't really escape that. That's part of our lives. There are going to be challenges, issues, situations everywhere. But if we get really good at doing that and we make that our life purpose, we become a source of higher energy for everybody and we become in essence a problem solver, an energy unwinder, maybe even a, uh, person who can change the environment, an alchemist, if you will. And whatever comes your way, you're gonna know how to shift that energy, to bring that disorder into harmony. And your life is gonna be a lot better for it. So start where you are, look at the things that you enjoy doing, the things that are easy for you, the places in your life where you can bring harmony to a lack of harmony, without really breaking a sweat. Maybe you just really enjoy doing that sort of thing. Like I follow a guy on YouTube, really amazing website and video series. 
he loves to fix motorcycles. Like he can take something that's just not running and go in there and in 30 minutes, it's gonna run, right? He's bringing harmony to the lack of harmony and the lack of maintenance and the lack of fixing that that motorcycle went through and, and everyone enjoys seeing it. And ultimately that's what inspires us. So to have a life purpose of inspiration, think about that for you and then begin to do it in your daily life because you probably already are. And then just take that ability to the workplace, to the vocation, to the marketplace and watch your life expand in a really big way and understand you are 100% dealing with energy and matter. You're bringing it into order and possibility. And I know each of you have that ability. So check it out in your life. See where you're doing that now. And if you enjoyed this video, hit like and subscribe. You've already found your life purpose. Chances are you came to the planet to do this. Bring order where there was once disorder and disharmony. Thanks for watching.